This is uh, more like a modern jazz kind of yeah. arrangement. Yeah. Very nice, playful, cheerful. Uh, good to listen to, listen to easy listening, you know. Uh, cheerful, upbeat music definitely will put you in a good mood, in a better mood than what you are, uh, if you are in a bad mood. This is good music, good music, you know. It's definitely got those strong uh, modern jazz influences in them, off and on. Uh, but it sometimes it gets totally unique. This is one of those typical modern jazz uh, songs, you know, uh, that you listen to. And there's so many of them out there today. I mean, we've not listened to a lot of them, to be honest. They haven't been requested that much on this channel. But there are a lot that I've heard in my life. So I know there's a lot of music like this out there. It's nothing unique. But yeah, it's good to listen to. It's good music. Uh, from the listen, it also felt like that there's supposed to be a context or there's supposed to be a significance of this uh, uh, factory that was mentioned in the title of the song and hence uh, it was selected uh, to be part of the album uh, where we are listening to so much instrumentals and uh, amazing themes around different uh, uh, concepts and this happened uh, a factory happened to be a concept uh, as well over here uh, from the listen uh, start and the end were similar something upbeat something uh, uh, something uh, positive but there was a point in the song where it felt very intense and something dark as well so I'm just uh, taking a guess and taking the liberty to say what I think. It felt like um, something else is the promotional uh, or the propaganda around the factory, but it seems uh, on the inside or on the reality, on the real side, it seems something darker or something you know hidden uh, that was supposed to be portrayed uh, through this composition. I could be wrong, but it, that's exactly what I felt while listening to it because there was definitely there was a brighter side and there was a darker side in the music when I was listening to it. Uh, but I'm not too sure if it is actually uh, related to a real factory place or it's just uh, uh, you know pigmentation of the creator or the composition uh, compos uh, yeah, yeah composer over here. Uh, so that I'm not sure about. But there were definitely two polar things that were put there.